What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. My name is James. So it's officially starting to get beautiful out. I got to really enjoy the day yesterday. I hope everybody enjoyed their holiday, but I want to go over a garment with you that I'm very excited about. One of my 2023 goals was to wear something that's unique in the sense of like a brand that I'm not familiar with. If you have been following along with my vlog videos, my most recent vlog video was I went to this event called All We Remember. It was at Independence, local Chicago boutique. They make some really really, really cool stuff. I highly recommend if you're in Chicago, go and check out Independence. It's a cool area as well, so you can go get food and a drink and everything like that. So this is a brand called All We Remember. They make organic garments. And when I say organic garments, I'm not referring to just like they use organic cotton. They use organic dyeing methods like vegetable tanning. The buttons that they use on the garments are going to be, I believe they're called Corzo buttons, which is essentially like a nut that's used that holds up very, very well. It's super strong. Strong. Their focus is on sustainability and making sure that everybody's receiving a livable wage. They're a small base company out of Chicago. The garment that I bought is the One Pocket LS Knit Pullover, and the color that I chose is pomegranate green. I don't have a lot of green, so it's a good earthy tone. The cotton itself, it's 100% organic cotton, and it's 11 ounce like fleece pill feel. It is a 100% made in America garment, which I thought was really important to me. As I was saying previously, I'm really trying to buy stuff that is not really a part of the hype or isn't as exciting, maybe a little bit lesser known garments to, to the world. And that way I can kind of share them with you and I can wear something and, and really appreciate it. And I think all we remember is a great version of that. Don't know exactly when they were founded, but they are extremely small. Their stuff, again, they're focusing on 100% organic cottons, organic dyeing, livable wages, things like that. If you check out the description below, there's a link to the website and it'll tell you like literally every single thing that they do. But let's get into the garment, I'm rambling. So like I was saying, this is the One Pocket LS Pullover. Something that I really like about the garment itself is the paneling. So you'll see like right across the body that it's one piece of material. And then the upper part is gonna be one piece of material as well, but it kind of goes into the shoulders as well as arms. So it almost gives you like a mock look or like a drop shoulder without having the seam on the shoulder. You can definitely tell that this was done by somebody that was a trained seamstress. My favorite feature is on the bottom left, right where like your hip would be is a single pocket. And you can tell inside the pocket they used a heavy canvas, which you know is going to be really strong. And then if you look to the left and to the right of the pocket, so this is like a denim thing, but it looks like they bar tacked it. So you know the garment is going to hold up. I went with a pomegranate green because I wanted more earthy tones, and especially now that we're getting into spring. I love how it suits with my capital number five denim. Those are like the mud dyed denim with like the indigo shishiko. I think it's just a perfect kind of combination with that. It gives you a really great earthy tone look to it. So let's get into size and then price. All We Remember is a gender neutral brand. So they don't have your traditional sizing from small, medium, men's, women's, yada, yada, yada. So the sizes they went with are going to be zero to I believe five. Zero obviously being the smallest and then five being the largest. To give you an idea of perspective, I am about five, eight, 175 pounds and I wear between a two and a three. I would probably say that for the most part I would be a two uh, depending on the garment I, I might be a three or how I want it to fit if I want it to be more relaxed fitting then I would go with a three if I wanted it to be more casual more tight fitting I went with a two but this crew neck itself I went with a two because I wanted it to fit more like a tight knit fitting shirt and I thought that was important because I wanted to be able to just throw some jeans with it but then if I wanted to put some black slacks and like go to like a nice dinner you know what I mean some worries where I don't want to be wearing like street clothes that kind of thing and and then Victoria wears the zero, and the zero fits her a little bit more boxy. She's about 5'4", I'm not gonna talk about her weight because she'll kill me. She wears the zero, and it fits her nice. She ended up cropping it. I compare them very similar to, um, there's a brand called, I, I can't remember the name off, my, off the top of my head, but they're kind of like organic Japanese inspired kind of clothing. It's like, Sudukes, I, I don't wanna say the name, but then it's like 7119NYC. Their stuff is amazing as well. Definitely check them out if you can. Let's talk about price though. 
is expensive. This crew neck is probably the most expensive crew neck that I've bought that doesn't have a designer name behind it. My crew itself was $395. And that is a lot of money. Like a lot, a lot of money for a crew neck. $395, the t-shirts are 55. There's a lot of reasons why this is kind of what it is. Again, it is 100% made in America. It is using natural organic dyes. It's using natural organic cottons. And then again, the, the structure of it. This isn't something that you can just buy a blank of and then remake. Like if you look again, like the back paneling over here is one piece and then it comes down to the shoulders. There's no seams until you get to like the mid arm, which is kind of insane. And then in the front, you have, again, that front paneling and then that bottling paneling, and then you have bar tacked pocket. So there's a lot of work that goes into it. It's not something that they just are like, oh, we're organic, we can charge you more money. Like this is something that the person that started this company had a huge amount of intent. Like the, the garment itself isn't something, you just have somebody that's been working for two weeks and put it on. It's gonna take somebody who knows what they're doing to kind of start this project and, and do this. So I'm willing to pay for that. And especially for something that I know is going to last. Think about that when you're doing it, when you're buying something like that. It is a lot of money but if you buy it once and you have it for 10 years, but it makes an easier pill to swallow. So that's something to think about. Definitely an investment piece. Um, the t-shirts itself, like I was saying, are a little bit more palatable. They're $55. You'll see that it's just, this one itself is an organic cotton. I believe it's just under six ounces, 5.75 ounce. It's an organic jersey material. The thing that I like about it is you can tell it's an organic cotton and it's, you can still see like the seeds on there and it's undyed, so it's got that kind of brown hue to it, which I like considering the fact that I feel like everything I own, I end up staining. Give you an idea, here's again, the tag. So the tag itself, you can see the seeds inside of it. And then you can see like made in USA. So to bring everything full circle, yeah, all we remember, made in American company, it is expensive. So something to think about when purchasing. I think it is worth the money because you're getting something that you're supporting a local business. You are supporting like crafts people and you're getting a bit of a unique piece. So I, I think it is worth the money. I highly recommend the brand. I think it's worth going into. Definitely check them out on independence.com or even go on their website to check it out as well. That's all I have to say. I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you soon. Goodbye.